we're here today at the Cause Curs Conference. The conference has been funded by Health of Mind and it's bringing together curs from all across the province to discuss curs issues and mental health and awareness issues. Staff need to recognise that the person who's becoming unwell probably has some very close family members or partners who are going through a traumatic event themselves and they need some warmth and some inclusion in what's happening. Staff need to, to be able to have a conversation to make those people feel that they're going to be part of helping this person and supporting this person. They've probably been doing it for a while anyway without recognising what's been happening. So staff just to give that recognition, not to take an awful lot of their time because people won't be able to take a lot of information on board at that stage, but they just need reassurance that there's somebody maybe on the end of a phone, a phone number, a named person that they can talk to either if somebody's on a ward or um, with the community team. There's a number of different factions can be done here. If they feel someone's gone unwell, they need to be listened to right away. They need to be taken on board what the person is saying because at that time they're, they're the ones with the most information. The, serve, the person who's becoming unwell at that time is in a very starting stage, so they're not really sure what's happening, but the curve would have seen how the progression of this illness has actually begun to take over their lives. So it's very important they sit down and they talk with the curve, but also bring it in the service user and, and let that partnership begin from the very beginning, rather than having people on separate places, because this is when this trust starts to build up. Thank you.